go ahead and state your name and who you're with. Um, good afternoon. My name is Elena Booth. I am a, the social justice chairwoman of the Baton Rouge branch of the NAACP. Um, as you've heard, criminal justice and civil rights are directly related. Louisiana leads in wrongfully convicting people in the United States, which you have also heard. This fact is especially important because I am an East Baton Rouge Parish public defender. I have 195 clients and a lot of them are sitting in jail, not anything proven against them. When my clients are accused of any type of wrongdoing, they do not get the benefit of anything like qualified immunity before they have to sit in jail for months and sometimes even years where they have lost their jobs, family, and enjoyment of life. I don't mean to know how many times I have filed a motion because of excessive force was used and there was a clear violation of their right. But my client gets an offer to get them out of jail. So many of those cases with excessive force do not come to light. When my clients ask me, can they seek any type of justice? And I have, because they have lost their apartments, jobs, and a few months is just enough for a person to have a major setback in their life. And I have to let them know Actually, you can, but the law is not on your side in this situation because of qualified immunity. I do not believe by no mistake that most of my clients are African American. The Baton Rouge branch of the NAACP strongly supports HB 51, and I'm asking each one of you to vote favorably and send this bill to the floor. Thank you. Thank you.